Good evening, everybody. The girls' high school golf districts took place today in Kirksville. Individually, Brooke Fields, Miranda White was the medalist on the day. Great touch on the first hole. She shot a 90 on the tough Kirksville Country Club course. Kirksville's Shade Shorten shot a 96. It was good for a second place tie with Chandler Wilson of Trenton. Wilson will get the putt to fall. Besides Shorten, Kirksville's Ellie Dublin, Mariko Weber, and Jordan Edwards all qualified for sectionals. La Plata will send three golfers, McKay Belt, Morgan Kimmel, and Nancy McKenzie Adams, while Putnam County will send Kaylee Campbell and Sydney O'Reilly to Chillicothe. In high school football, Cooks looked better Friday night, but they still lost to Boonville as they came away with a 42-26 loss. The effort was there, however. In order to get back in the win column, the Tigers need a solid effort for four quarters. We're playing good football. We're just not being consistent. And uh, we've been turning the ball over at crucial times and missing tackles at crucial times. But uh, we just need to put it all together for all four quarters. Uh, Tom Way is back on the winning track after last Friday's 21-3 win over Mason City. The Bulldogs hit the road this week to face Dowling Catholic but the key until kickoff will be to continue to work hard. It's a process for us just to focus on daily improvement, trying to get better every day, trying to practice hard, play hard, give a tremendous effort and, and uh, grow as a team. The latest Iowa football poll is out. Pekin is fifth in Class A. In college football, Truman State let one slip away against Fort Hay State on Saturday. It's a tough, tough loss, a bitter loss last weekend. Uh, arguably, it's, you know, I count on one hand the times I've had that where you felt like you just kicked one away and, and uh, gave one away. you got to give credit to Hayes. I mean, they came in and fought and did a great job.